Prince William reveals he has not yet been asked to be best man at the wedding. Joked that he would try and prevent a clash between his brother's wedding to Meghan Markle and the FA Cup final at Wembley on May 19. Spoke of how his mother's death had bought him and Harry closer. Prince Harry has not yet asked his brother to be his best man, Prince William claimed tonight. The royal also joked that as president of the FA, he is still working on the diary clash that sees the royal wedding being held on the same day as the FA Cup final. Many have expressed surprise that Harry and fiancé Meghan Markle chose one of the biggest days in the British sporting calendar to tie the knot at Windsor Castle, on Saturday, May 19. But both Kensington Palace and the FA insist there will be no direct clash between the nuptials and the match and that it will very much be a day to remember. With Harry having acted as best man for his brother when he married the Duchess of Cambridge in 2011, William is expected to be a shoe-in for the role. William talked about the wedding as he joined a discussion of what makes a best man at an event run by the Campaign Against Living Miserably CLM, a charity aimed at preventing male suicide through open discussion which has recently launched a best man project celebrating men's friendship. Radio DJ Roman Kemp, Compring, highlighted the Duke's own role as best man in the coming months. Laughing, he replied, he hasn't asked me yet. Just to clear that up, it could be a sensitive subject. Asked by footballer Rio Ferdinand about the awkward clash of dates on May 19th which means William is likely to miss the final match itself he replied he was trying to see what I can do about the situation. William went on to speak about his relationship with his brother, emphasizing the importance of men speaking openly to one another about their emotions. Our relationship is closer than it's been because of the situation we've been through, he said. Losing our mother at a young age it's helped us travel through that difficult patch together. You're like-minded you go through similar things, it's a bond and it's something you know you've tackled together and come out better for it. That's the thing about being a best mate. Inevitable one of you is sometimes on an up while the other is on a down. You're always there for each other and repaying that favor. Of his own approach to discussing his feelings, following his mother's death, the Duke continued, Personally I didn't want to be a burden. So I knew that if I trapped this inside and it got worse, and inevitably I would get worse in the future and I'd be a burden to my friends and family. I didn't want that for my life I didn't want the traumatic moment that happened to me to then affect my life for the rest of my life and I knew my mother wouldn't want that for me either. So I actively went around dealing with it. Talking about it. Arguing men can be the worst for opening up, he added, we've got to break that down where it's okay to talk. Sons, fathers, it's okay to have that chat. Someone's got to be the brave one and take the first step. Say I'm putting it out there, that upset me, or that pissed me off. You've got to take that initial step to bring the conversation to a head. CLM is one of the key charity partners of Heads Together, the campaign led by the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and Prince Harry. The charity is particularly focused on services for men in crisis or distress, in an age where suicide is the single biggest killer of men under the age of 45 in the UK. William has previously spoken of being called to a suicide on his first shift as an air ambulance pilot, and how it has informed his charity work since. Their long-term campaigning is directed at bringing about a culture change to redefine and open up masculinity so that over time fewer men will need support.